Hello everyone, I've just got the Samsung Galaxy Buds and I cannot wait to unbox it and show it to you. This is just an unboxing video with first impression and a setup guide. A detailed review will follow up that will be more of a help guide to fix problems and the existing issues with the earbuds that I've experienced and also how to use the Galaxy Buds. So make sure you have subscribed to our channel if you don't want to miss those videos. Now let's quickly unbox the birds. Cannot wait. But first a big thanks to Samsung for inviting me to their S10 India launch event and giving me these Galaxy Buds as a thanks for attending the event. So here's the box. It's a small box, quite lightweight that says Buds. Here you can see some more features of the new Galaxy Buds. So it says it gives 6 hours of music time which is impressive and it also supports wireless charging as you must have seen in the pictures and the videos of S10 launch. And also these Galaxy Buds are touchpad enabled. Now the cost of these Galaxy Buds in India is around 9990 rupees or you can now get it for 5000 if you buy an S10 device. So these are as usual designed and developed in partnership with Soundmasters AKG and Samsung has partnered with AKG since their S7 Edge device launch and I can see this association getting more stronger. Anyways, let's quickly open the box. So the box contains a capsule that contains the earbuds and then there's a paper box which contains oh the attachments and a USB type C cable. That's nice. Now there are a lot of attachments so you can experiment with different Galaxy Bird attachments and get the best and the most comfortable fit for your ears. Now let's look at the capsule and the earbuds. I got the white earbuds and I know they are gonna get messy sooner but the white looks cool and it's more visible as well uh, than the black ones. Now the container is magnetic so nothing to click. Just open it and the two Galaxy Buds. One for the right and another for the left of course and you can't wear them wrong even mistakenly cause they won't fit in. The earbuds have this quite touch sensitive surface so you can control music and volume or use Google Assistant or Bixby with various taps on any one Galaxy Bird. For example, you can single tap to play or pause music or double tap to change to the next track or triple tap to listen to the previous track and finally you can tap and hold to use Bixby or voice assistant. Further you can tap and hold on both birds to turn on the pairing mode and then you can pair it with another device. By default as soon as you open the box the Galaxy Birds will pair automatically with the last paired Galaxy device or any other Android device. But you have to set up them first and it's very easy for the Android users. iPhone users can also use but they won't be able to use these birds to their full potential. Now for the Android users all you have to do is open the Galaxy Bird capsule and then turn on the Bluetooth on your Galaxy or Android device. Android users who own devices other than the Samsung need to install Samsung Wear app from the Play Store. Then you have to tap on the Galaxy Buds in the Bluetooth scan and this will start the pairing process. So just follow along through the setup wizard and allow all the permissions and let the app set up your Galaxy Buds which will take around a minute, hardly a minute. So this is just a one time process and from the next time as soon as you open the box put them in your ears and till the time you will take out your galaxy device it will already be connected and it's all seamless. Then all you have to do is tap on the earbuds to start the music or ask Bixby or the Google assistant to call someone. Pretty neat right? No. Cause these birds do have some issues as I said earlier, which I'll be addressing in a separate video. I've used these Galaxy Buds for last three days, but I will take a few more days to test them thoroughly and come up with the solutions of the problems and the issues that I'm experiencing with these Galaxy Buds. 
and you will also face these issues and challenges out of the box but these issues are not deal breakers because they are completely fixable it's just the software settings that you have to tweak so subscribe now to get more updates on the samsung galaxy birds videos like this video to show your support and comment your thoughts likes or dislikes about the new samsung galaxy birds and what you think samsung galaxy birds or the airpods which one looks more cool let me know via comments down below thank you for watching have a great day